Hi, it's Sheena from Adventure RV Group here in Napa, California. Today I want to show you the 2023 Forest River Wolf Pup 18 RJB. It's a toy hauler and it's really short, it's really lightweight, and I want to show you some of the new features that really benefit the customer. First of all, you'll notice it's a new color, because why not? We can change things, keep things fresh and exciting, and it sure looks good. Uh, the other thing that I really like about this is they've given you reflective windows. The reflective windows don't just look really cool, but they're actually helping your solar gain. That means that you're not gonna take on as much heat on those hot summer days, keeping you more comfortable inside. Along here, you have a baggage door. It's a, it's a nice size opening, so you can really fit the hammock, the chairs, the tiki torches, whatever you wanna put in there. Uh, it fits really nicely. You've got four stabilizer jacks all the way around. You've got the extra wide entr entrance door for any cargo that you're carrying up and down. It's a toy hauler, so I imagine you're gonna be carrying gas tanks and all sorts of fun stuff in there with a nice solid handle. The other thing that I really like about these trailers is they're giving you the solid entry step. That's really nice for <laughs> if you've had one too many or you just want to make sure that you're not shaking while you're carrying anything up and down those steps. Right up above me is your awning. I love the power awnings. It's one of the first things that we get set up when we go camping, whether it's pouring down rain or the sun's beaming down. This is going to be a nice relief out of the sun when you're setting up shop and sweating doing it. So this is a great area. You've got the LED party lights up here. Those make for a great backup. If you've forgotten your lantern, done it. If you have broken your lantern, also done it. Uh, it makes for just a nice area where you can see what's going on out front, even if you've forgotten any alternative lighting. On the front here, they do give you outdoor speakers for your entertainment center. This is gonna be the ability to plug in a TV out here. This gives you a little cable spot. It's very cool. You can hang your TV if you want, or for the couple times that you're gonna set that up, you can put a TV on a table. That works too. Down here, I wanna point out the tire pressure indicator. The tire pressure indicator is going to tell you when your tire pressure has gone too low. It shows green right now. It will show red if you lose a little bit of tire pressure. So that's a really cool, fast safety check that Wolf Pup Gray Wolf is doing for you. The other thing I wanna point out is what this black thing right here is. This is an air vent. You can open those up from the inside because they're assuming that you might have gas tanks or toys that smell like gasoline. That's gonna help keep the place smelling good. Let me show you the back. And here's where the toys go in and out. You can roll up your kayaks, your motorbikes, your golf cart, your little boat, whatever it is, you can roll it all inside. Uh, this is a great storage space up here. I think you've got about nine foot four lengthwise. And then in two different spots, you're gonna have 46 and 56 inches wide. So you can really pack in a lot of fun toys. On the back here, you've got your backup camera. You've got a work light or party light, however you want to look at it. <laughs> and the best part about this ramp is it turns into a patio. So let me show you how easy this is. Mm -mm, how easy. <laughs> Mark my words. I promise you I've done this a few times. But here is the clip. There is one, that's the hardest part. I promise I only practiced twice. <laughs> it is quite easy. You've just gotta find out where you need to put that weight. There we go. And we are locked and loaded. Now we can open up for the patio. So we do have a couple pieces of Velcro just to keep everything nice and contained. While traveling, I do like to put these somewhere where I can easily access them so that I don't lose any parts. So I put them back on. Back
back on the unit so that I can really just clean up pretty quickly. So these open up and then it'll contain the kids, the wife, the dog, whatever you want to keep contained in there. This makes for a great, I mean, you can fish off the back. If you've got the close spot to the river, you can sunbathe out here, you know, whatever, use your imagination. It's a great, great spot. So let's show you the inside. So we're inside this little wolf pup toy hauler. They've done a nice job of giving you as much fun space as functional space. Right here, I wanna point out this big window that we are looking at from the outside. That's gonna give you a ton of fresh air. It's also gonna allow you to yell at your friends or your kids, whatever it is. Uh, it's a great, great window. Over here, you have the control center. This is gonna show you all the important stuff, how much fresh water you have, how much black water you have, gray water, battery, all that good stuff. You can connect via Bluetooth to this so you can also see a lot what's going on on your phone. Uh, this'll be how you bring the awning in and turn on your water pump and some of those lights. Over here, you've got your front queen size bed. Previous models, they've done a double bed. It's just not enough space. So they've gone with a queen size bed with a bunk on top, whether you're throwing a kit up there or using it as extra storage. I definitely can see the function there. Underneath, they've made it. So this lifts up. So you don't have to go outside to get to your baggage area. You can also access it here. That tire can go anywhere you'll like. And the bathroom, it's pretty roomy for a little unit. Keep in mind, this whole unit is only 22 feet, nine inches total length. So everything they've done here is really thought out. I'm actually very impressed. It's not that wet bath. They're giving you the separate toilet from shower and there's lots of space for elbow room for washing those, those spots on you. In the kitchen portion of the toy hauler, down below the refrigerator, you've got your battery disconnect switch. That's gonna be something that keeps the health of your battery a little bit better. So if you put it into storage, you would disconnect your battery so that there's not a slow drain on it. So once it dies and sits there, it's going to end up dying fully. And then you have to replace your battery. Nobody likes to do that. Uh, this is your huge refrigerator. I think we've moved up to the 11 cubic foot refrigerators. It's a really awesome refrigerator. It starts to get cold instantly as soon as it's plugged in and turned on on the battery. It's a DC refrigerator. Uh, holds a lot of food. You can bring, you can invite the whole family for Thanksgiving meal with this kind of fridge. Down below, you've got your converter, your carbon monoxide, and your propane furnace. All things that you need to have on a travel trailer. Really nice, conveniently located. The kitchen is pretty fully loaded. You've got this glass cover on the stove top, two range stove. It's a really nice little feature to have the LED light here that lights it up. A uh, huge kitchen sink, really deep bowl. I love that for keeping water contained. It does a nice job. And then above here, you've got your minimized fan, which keeps just it out of your face when you're cooking and it'll suck that, that gross, greasy air out of the way. Microwave and storage. You know, I love the storage. I love to bring a lot of stuff camping. So having just this extra amount of storage anywhere we can find is really, really important. And you've got more storage down here. Right next to me, I have the table so that we can easily walk in and out. But this table can go right in between here so that you can have a really lovely game of gin rummy, uh, Monopoly, whatever your pleasure, or maybe you're going to eat inside. And just to send this home, this is such a cool view. I can only imagine being next to the river. So come check out this unit. It's a great toy hauler, and hopefully it fits your family perfectly.